Hey, Alicia, how are you? Hey, Bonnie, I'm great. It's good to see you as always. Good to see you too. Uh, so we're here actually to talk about the holidays, which is my favorite season. Me too. Um, so I'm going to kick off and dive right in and ask you my first question. All right. Why are experiences so important around the holidays? Oh my gosh. Well, the holidays are an experience in and of themselves, but I think the reason that they're so important for brands is because it's the moment where people are looking to make those kind of connections. So there's a really natural way to have those conversations um, with the people that are most important to you. I also think experiences are so important around the holidays because it's just a time when people really form memories. So how magical is it to be able to form a memory around your brand? Why do you think it's so important, Bonnie? I just love the word uh, magic. <laughs> so <laughs> I, I think about magical. I think about magic. I think about lights. I think about fun. So I love that. Everything you said and more. I have a question for you. All right. What are the two to three things that a brand must consider when they're thinking about experiences around the holidays, in your opinion? Okay, I'm going to build off of what you just said because I love everything. And when you think about magic, like what that what that evokes, um, I think you need to ask yourself or brands need to ask themselves, does it bring them joy? Like whoever's creating it, does it bring them joy? And then you, more, most importantly, does it bring their customers or their consumers joy? Because it's the holiday season. I also think, I mean, it's the biggest shopping time of the year, right? So this is an opportunity for brands to give everybody some inspiration uh, for what gifts to get, gift giving, it's about giving. So we also should be making sure that we're incorporating some way to give back and make that easy for people to do good for others. And then you said it, it's the moments that matter, right? So when we think about the holidays, there's food, there's drinks, you can have so much fun with it and you're making memories. So this is the time to go haywire with the photo moments and the glam moments yeah. um, with all the lights. I love that. I love that. I think what you said about bringing joy is just so important. I think another thing that I like to think about is that, and it's so counterintuitive as a brand marketer, but it's not all about you in this moment. It's really about your um, attendees and the people that you want to engage. So let's make sure to put everything through the filter of what's going to bring them joy. Exactly. I love it. Bringing them joy. All right. Next question for you. What are the big watch outs, things that people and brands should avoid? I think a couple of things. I mean, going back to what we just talked about, right? So putting your, your attendees, your customers first, I think making sure that you don't make it all about yourself is a watch out. I think, um, and we'll talk a little bit about this probably as well, but like making sure that as many people can participate as possible in any of the experiences that we bring forward. So if we're in a particular location and we can have people to join us there, great. But also what about all the people that are very used to in this environment now joining from home in a virtual or a hybrid environment? There's lots of great ways to kind of include them as well. Yeah, I agree. And when you're when you're thinking about like what to avoid too, it's when you say to make sure it's all about your, you know, the people who are experiencing it is making sure it's not a singular thought. Because I think during the holidays, everybody has a way for how they experience the holidays. So as a marketer, you know, don't go into it with one perspective, right? A hundred percent agree. And I think building on that, Bonnie, what are your thoughts about how we can make sure that we make any of our holiday activations really inclusive? This is a good question. Because <laughs> you're right, it is building on what I just said. So, I mean, I think when we think about holidays, obviously the joy and the festivities, but a lot of people think about family. And I, and I think it's important to recognize that not all families look the same. Family also doesn't mean the same thing, right, to everyone. So I think it's just important to recognize that. I also think, you know, the holidays are about different beliefs. Um, so sometimes you can lean into that. Sometimes you want to, you, you don't want to lean into that. It's more about the holiday spirit and the season in itself. So it's really just important to, as a brand, lean into your brand values. That's who you are. It's how you should act. It's your tone, your personality, and how you show up in the world and the good that you do. Um, and then that will show for your consumers, your buyers, your customers, and it'll all be good after that. Um, all right. Last question for you. And it's the most important question hot cocoa or apple cider love that question i am a hot cocoa girl all the way with more marshmallows the better i was gonna be upset if you said apple cider 